Police say David Benola was the handyman and ex-lover of the victim. A love affair that allegedly turned deadly on April 16th, minutes after the mother of two teens returned home from seeing a show and having a nightcap at a local bar. Officials say Benola confronted 51-year-old Orshalia Gall inside her basement and allegedly stabbed her 58 times. Police then say the 44-year-old suspect put Gall into her son's hockey bag, then dumped the bag near Metropolitan Avenue and Jackie Robinson Parkway. About a half a mile from her Forest Hills home. According to sources, a man walking his dog found the bag and called the police during the investigation. Detectives later found boots, a shirt, and bloody bandages. They determined Bonola got medical treatment for wounds to both hands. Once he was taken into police custody, police say Bonola made incriminating statements. Police arrested Bonola on charges of murder, criminal tampering, and criminal possession of a weapon. Following the arrest, residents who live near Benola's Ozone Park home and Gall's home reacted to the crime and how it must be impacting her children. A 13-year-old, his life was ruined. You know, living in the same house, you know, being in the house while this was going on, he's going to feel guilt for the rest of the life that he didn't hear it. A lot of stuff has been going on recently. It's, it's kind of ridiculous. The sources tell PIX11 News Benola allegedly sent a chilling text to Gall's husband threatening to kill his whole family. Benola has no known priors and is the only suspect in this case.